you are, of course, one of the most prolific composers to ever work for Transformers franchise. Uh, have you ever listened to work by other well-known composers for this franchise from East or West? Um, for example, the work of Michiaki uh, Watanabe, who recently, sadly, passed away. He did work on Transformers Victory and Transformers Zone. Uh, have you ever worked, uh, or have you ever listened to work by him or by other composers for this franchise? I don't know his work, to be honest with you. Mm -hmm. um, and, and, as far as other composers, are you saying, are you asking? For this franchise, for the uh, um, You know, when, when, when the movie, the live action movie idea came up in 2006, because I know the movie came out in 2007. Actually, the idea probably came out years before that. I assumed, I made a mistake, and you don't make this mistake in, in the music business. I assumed that because I had done the movie uh, in 1980, the animated movie in 1986, that I would at least be considered for some part of the live action movie. The fact that I wasn't, and the fact that Michael Bay actually made a point of saying, we don't want any of the elements from the animated movie in the live action movie, that was very depressing to me. Mm. Uh, it took me a while to get over that. Um, Steve Jablonski, he did a really good job. Um, I'm, I'm very respectful of his work. I tried to, uh, I actually got in touch with him to ask if, you know, to make it known that if he needs any additional music, I'm happy to do it. But he didn't. And, and he wasn't being disrespectful to me. He mm -hmm. basically has his team of people. Uh, and I appreciate that and I respect that. But I was very disappointed that I couldn't at least have a song in the movie um, or a part of a song in the movie. And, you know, but Steve's work is great. Uh, and I appreciate, again, the business. He worked with Michael Bay on the movie The Island. And that's where they had a, 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 an agreement that Michael Bay said, my next action movie, I want you to score it. And in the end, next action movie happened to be the first live action Transformers movie. So that's how that relationship came about. Um, but I, th I think he did a terrific job. And that's, that's basically the only composer, as far as the Transformers franchise, I don't know anything about the TV show, believe it or not, to this day. Mm -hmm. I've never watched it, so I don't know the music that was composed for that. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Thank you for your answer and thank you for your work. No, thank you.